Hey guys, hello and welcome back here at Let's Show Minecraft Real Life Mode. I was ill the last two days, that's why there wasn't no new video. So, that's number six of Let's Show Minecraft Real Life Mode and it's the um, Let's Show for version 0.16, but uh, there will be a patch for this version uh, very soon because I recognized that it crashes in multiplayer and there are some other issues. So, yeah, let's show what is new in version 0 0.16. So, first uh, thing is the uh, sideboard. It is not usable, it's just a normal block at the moment. Uh, let's see where we can get it. It is in furniture, as always. And where should it be else? It's furniture, a sideboard. So you can place it in all directions. Um, it is why it is two blocks, but it uh, is always placed in the middle of a block. So yeah, you can decorate your house with it just as I do. Just put a sideboard here on this floor. And now, are there any new furniture blocks? I don't think so. But there are some awesome new features with this release. And I already showed them in my 100 subscribers special link to this special where you can win some awesome stuff if you are fast enough uh, is in the description. So, um, I reviewed it, but I will show you again, because it's a uh, all-round show showcase. So, I've forgotten where it is. It's here. S um, yeah, so it's just here, and we'll go... Where will we go? Oh, hello, Mr. Doctor. Oh, there we have it. We already have a tree. But I will place a new one here, and then you'll have to hear and watch. So, new sound when you place the tree. The rendering isn't finished yet, but you can see there are some uh, fur leaves and stuff, but they are a bit buggy. So, I just take an axe to cut this tree down. A nice little diamond axe, and... BAM! It is actually a falling tree in Minecraft. So I think this is an awesome feature. If you like it, please leave a like and a comment below. So, this is the first new feature. And of course, it's uh, still WIP. So I'm working on it all the time and I try to make it as best I can. So, the next feature is in the character setup. And you just have to press L to use it. So we press L and you can see the items also render in the hand of this funny little guy. And yeah, my name is of course, it's uh, Mysterious Mods. So you can actually use tab to switch between these two uh, edit fields. Then uh, you have a date of birth which actually changes every day because it's not saved at the moment. And uh, you can set your name first it's not saved at the moment I don't know why because it has been saved before and I can't remember what I actually changed that uh, before it wasn't saved anymore so you can change your hair color as before have fiery red hairs nice blonde hairs and white hairs as an old grandpa has so purple hairs I love purple hairs no um a little bit green and there we have normal brown hairs so that's it for the hairs but as you can see there is a new button here and I just put these legs back into their position using the R key and then here's a new button dressing room this is the new feature and if we click it BAM there you have this nice new guy and what you can do is rotate around the entity 360 degrees so rotate it around completely and just put it on zero again and now you can you have this button here so there you will be able to change your clothes and dress and put on your pajama and everything but is 
uh, not finished. So it's a little preview of what you will be able to. So if you click on the button has cap, bam, it, he has a cap. He wears a nice little cap on his weird head. So, yeah, yeah, I'm a rapper. I'm a rapper with my diamond axe in my hand. So, that's it for the character. Uh, now I changed some animations so you can see the item right now and I have a hitting animation that's kind of weird because it's random uh, at the moment. So I'll have to work on this. Um, yeah, hitting animation, what else? Um, nothing changed with the swimming. No, it's just like before. Uh, yeah. One new thing, uh, these workers. So, uh, if you want to be such an entity with weird arms, no, such an entity, uh, you just have to log in, uh, you just have to register on our website. So, the link is cloudolympus.ca uh, and also in the description. You just have to reg uh, register and in a few weeks or months, you will be an entity in game automatically uh, until we wrote this API uh, we will add you normally so in code yeah that's it for this review I think or have I forgotten anything no not that I yes there are uh, three new things here three new armor stuff but they don't work at the moment uh, they will protect you uh, from fire as it says fire protection uh, but they don't work at the moment so forget these and yeah so that's it for this review and I hope you liked the video guys if you do so leave a like and a subscription below and we'll see us next video bye